Hello YouTube family and welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can see here, I have a beautiful unit on my head that I had to come and give y'all the 411 on. This beautiful hair is by a company called Sage Extensions and I cannot wait to give you guys all of the details. So if you would like to see all of that and more, stay tuned. So first thing I wanted to start off by showing you guys the inside construction of this wig. So as you guys can see here, this wig is truly of quality. I know this is my first wig out of the gate, like real wig, but you can tell that Sage Extensions really took their time to make sure they delivered a quality wig. So this wig was actually made in conjunction with itsglamourhour.com, but if you guys want to get a wig made, of course you can work with Sage Extensions uh, to get all of that situated. So what I decided to do was just really show you guys what it looks like on the inside because I think that's important, right? You want to make sure your wigs are of quality. Another thing that's important to note is the fact that I did get a closure, but that closure has already been bleached and plucked for me. So that is amazing as well. So I won't have to do anything to this hair. All right, so now that we've looked at the inside construction of this wig, y'all, let's talk about this beautiful hair, okay? So this wig consists of 22... 20 and 18 inches of kinky curly textured hair as well as a 22 inch closure but as you guys can see here i wanted to tell you what this hair looks like on the mannequin hair because this is fresh out of the box of the hair there's no products on it and it's so beautiful like in full i'm so excited to rock this hair all right, so the first thing I'm going to do is actually wash the hair. I've decided that I want to do a wash and go because I never actually do that on my real hair. Um, so in order for me to do an effective wash and go, I want to make sure this hair is soaking wet and clean. So that is what we're going to start off by doing. As you guys can see right here, I'm using a comb to glide through the hair and just make sure I can get any tangles out. Y'all, I'm so impressed. I had to stop because there was no tangles in this hair whatsoever. Like, it was so easy for me to glide the comb through it with the shampoo in there. Absolutely amazing. So now that I have the hair washed, I am going to go ahead and just cut the lace off the front. As I mentioned, I do have three bundles and a regular closure here. I didn't go with a frontal this time just because I'm not, you know, I'm not an expert in the whole wig world. So I'd rather do a closure. Um, and then I'm just now going to just go ahead and apply some product to get that wash and go look. Um, I'm going to use Curls Mix uh, Conditioning, I think it's the flaxseed one, and then also uh, mix it with the Camille Rose um, gel to do the wash and go. So one of the things that really sold me on Sage Extensions was the fact that they really care about their customers and also the hair. They actually use a steam process versus a chemical process to do their hair, which is rare. Um, if you guys know anything about the hair care industry, a lot of the hair is created using chemical processing, which is why you hear a lot of people having to dip their hair in apple cider vinegar before they put it on their head because of the chemicals that are in the hair. So Sage has really invested their time and money in their hair to make sure that is something that their customers do not have to worry about. So I love that. Another thing that I love about this company is they also know that this type of hair is not something that is inexpensive. So they've created payment plans as well. So that's something like if you guys are worried about, okay, is this hair expensive? It's still reasonably priced, but also if you can't afford to dish all of that money out for a wig or the hair texture that you want, you can pay in installments. So that's amazing. All right, so after I actually finish this little portion up, I am going to diffuse the hair just a little bit and let it air dry overnight. y'all do y'all see 
this wig. Do y'all see this wig? This hair, like you could just tell from looking at it that it's some quality hair. You guys saw in the beginning where I kind of did a, a mini wash and go with the hair using just some natural hair products. And the curls are just so beautiful. The curls look really natural. It's super soft. Even when me putting the products on my hair, my hair doesn't feel crunchy or hard or greasy. It's super soft. Truth be told, I put the products on there because, again, this is my first my first version wig so I I didn't know for real but I truly think if I just took a Denman's brush and just put water on it that it would curl up just like it is right now I don't know if I even need the product just from looking at it like it really does hold curls super well like look at how pretty I mean and it seriously looks like the natural hair look at the closure and let's get into how this blend is happening y'all saw me put the wig on so but it's so pretty and defined, like, <laughs> I'm obsessed. I, I, I honestly can't lie, I'm obsessed with this wig. You guys also saw in the beginning, I did wash the hair. It was very minimal shedding. It was super easy for me to glide the dimming brush through the hair. There were no tangles, like I said. Like, so far, y'all, I don't have anything negative to say about this hair, period. When you invest in something like this, you want it to be of quality. So I can already tell they really have taking the time to make sure that their hair is of quality and even their construction of the wigs are of quality. So I'm feeling it. Anyway, that's all I really have for this video. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Everything that I'm wearing today will be down below in the description box, including the hair, the links, and all that good stuff. Definitely let me know your thoughts on the hair. You can also check them out on Instagram at Sage Extensions, but I'll put all that information down below in the description bar. And I can't wait to come back in a month and give you guys an update on this wig. So with that said, thank you guys so much for tuning in to my channel. I love you all. And until next time, 